A ratio gives the relationship between two quantities that can be used for comparisons. For example, the ratio 10 to 1 above, equals 10 parts water for one part of red dye. The ratio 3 to 2 equals 3 children for every two adults. Finally, the ratio 1 to 3 means one part of cement is to be mixed with three parts of sand. As an object increases in size, its outside surface and volume also increase. However, as a cube increases in size, its inside volume increases more than its outside surface area. Therefore, the ratio of the surface area per unit volume decreases with increasing size. In other words, as an object gets bigger, its surface area gets smaller compared to its volume. The ratio of 6 to 1, for the smallest cube, means that a total of 6 square surfaces are exposed to interact with the outside environment for every unit of cube volume. The ratio of 3 to 1, for the middle cube, means that a total of 3 square surfaces are exposed to interact with the outside environment for every unit of cube volume. The ratio of 2 to 1, for the largest cube, means that only a total of 2 square surfaces per unit volume are exposed for interaction with this outside environment. Most of the large cube surfaces are hidden inside the cube itself, and therefore not available to interact with the outside environment. If these cubes were placed in an environment where their surfaces can interact, the surface area to volume ratios would indicate their rate of interaction with the environment per unit volume per unit time.